everyone and welcome back to part eight of the sims 3 generations in seasons so in the last part um we basically just worked on Coraline and bryce's skills and i still want to continue to do that but as you can see Coraline is on a little bit of a date with this guy phoenix prudence um I didn't actually make them go on a date. They just did it on their own, which I think is cute as heck. So I kind of want them to go do something. But what is there to do? Because she's not hungry. Um, Let's see. Maybe we can go to the beach. It's kind of rainy. But I feel like... I feel like they should go to the beach. And like go swimming or something it's it's the first day of fall <laughs> but I don't know actually maybe what they should do is because he works at the command center go tour it with have him give her a tour of the command center I think that would be super cute just have a little casual date nothing fancy because you know, I don't see Cora really getting out there and actually dating. I just see her kind of having a tour of the theater. Oh, is there actually, there's a movie on. Why don't you go see a movie? Um, I'm dying, let's dance. That actually sounds like a decent movie. She's supposed to work in an hour. I think we're going to be missing work. Okay, so... Let okay, so he finished with this TV. Work for him comes in an hour. Um, okay, so let's put this back in the family inventory. And then who do we deliver it to? Um, where though? I'm actually not talk. Okay, but where is she? I'm not seeing where this person is. Where is this person? Um, let's see. Opportunities. Well, it can't go in his inventory, so I'm wondering. He has work, so go ahead and go to work. Um, go ahead and work hard for today. And I'm having Willow clean the house. Oh, you have mail. Or no, you don't. Your thingy's still up, though. Um, yeah, I'm having her clean the house. Because it's just disgusting. She cleaned that. She cleaned that. Okay. okay maybe it wasn't as horrible as I thought. It's just with the laundry everywhere. And then, like, this shredded up stuff all over the place. Okay, come over here and scratch. I really need you to do that. You needed to go to the bathroom before you went to work, but that's okay. Um, earn a raise. You just earned a raise. So you're probably not going to earn another one. Alright, and when she's done cleaning, I'm going to have her go ahead and go to the library to work on her book. Oh, clean that. Definitely clean that. And then do laundry. Set wash type. I don't know what... I don't know what the difference is between these. Is it like just if you've got like two things of clothes or a thing of clothes in there? I don't I don't actually know. I've never actually experimented with that to know the difference. Okay, you're following Willow around. That's great, but Okay, yeah. No, don't go to work. Just skip work. We don't, we don't care about work. It's fine. All right. So, oh, you do want to see Watch a movie. Join the stylist career. Ping. Turn a promotion. Um, you're probably just... I'm going to take away the stylist career because she's not going to be joining that for a while. Just, you know, until they go off to school. I'm pretty sure they have enough money to go to school. It's just I do want to get a little bit more. And I know they can get financial aid. But I want them to get scholarships. Especially Coraline. Because... If she goes to school, I think it's going to cost like 3,000 simoleons and Coraline is poor. So it would just add to her already big debt 
to be paying back, which, you know, isn't bad, but I kind of want to alleviate as much of our financial burden as possible. Okay, so they're going to see the movie. And then she's almost done cleaning. Okay, that was probably Cleo's doing. Don't put it on the ground. Don't put it on the ground. Oh. Put it in the... Mm -hmm. So you put it in the hamper. Okay, Willow. Okay. Whatever. All right, so actually before we go, because I know you'll have to like pee, use that. Take a shower and then head to the library. So yeah, I do want to level up their skills and things like that before they go to university. Okay, sorry guys, I had a call from my mother and like I've said before, always answer calls from your mother. All right, so Coraline is still there. She really needs to use the bathroom. And then Bryce is at work. Okay, you're still showering and about to go to the library. So I'm thinking um, future wise, what, why are you running? Um, that I'm kind of looking towards the future of this LP in regards to what's gonna happen after, you know, Coraline and Bryce get out of university. I really wish this would go down. And I'm I'm not sure how I really want things to unfold because I know that, you know, Willow really does not want to stay in the city. She wants to go out into the country and start her um, business being an equestrian and a writer. So I'm just kind of thinking, like, how is looking oh she took a trip i was like what she's not at the gallery haha <laughs> okay um continue writing 50 shades of sims 3 why are you streaming a video that's like horrible so where is your oh 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 okay um, so, saw a great chick flick. That's great. So, Russ is here at the theater, and Coraline is with this bow. Um, should we talk to him, or should we ignore him? I feel like, I feel like we should talk to him and be like, what's up? What's this I'm hearing about? you and this girl you know i feel like i feel like that would be something that Coraline would do uh, no don't invite him over don't invite him over um let's just talk about family okay so will is streaming last chapter stop streaming the video go and talk to him mm -hmm. Uh, or not receive oh, oh oh gosh russ is looking over like what what is going on why are you giving her flowers oh my gosh oh my gosh he is so jealous right now <laughs> He's so jealous right now. He's like looking over like, yeah, that used to be mine. That used to be my girl. Uh, oh my gosh, she's walking over. Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Um, no, don't invite him to join the conversation. So why don't you talk to him? Just, you know, like I said, be like... <laughs> <laughs> he looks so like sad almost like he looks almost sad that she's like talking to him but like they're not together i mean they do not like each other like ex-boyfriend like yeah i think he works here 
Otazapu Ubazal. Let's talk about our cat. Because, you know, we love cats. Oh, gosh, she's, like, vomiting. Like, ew, she's actually talking to that loser. Stwee! Oh, he's oh, giving us flowers again! Oh, oh my gosh. Robin. This is crazy. Oh my gosh, he is so mad. He is so mad. Oh gosh. She wants to kiss him. Um, okay. Sure. Let's let's kiss him. Um Oh no 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 don't don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Um he tell a dirt tell a dirt dirty joke. Okay. Um, let's do a heat of the moment kiss. Right. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> it's like crazy <laughs> right now. <laughs> okay, she's still writing that. <laughs> Nargle makes. <laughs> Tiku? <laughs> well, Mina? <laughs> okay, they're making weird faces at each other. <gasps> oh my! Top. They totally. Okay, yeah. Um, I don't know. Don't give him flowers. Kiss him, and then kiss him. Let's kiss him goodbye. Let's end the date. Actually, let's go eat somewhere. Let's go to the bistro and let's eat here with date for seventy-five simoleons. Let's. Have a good day. Love it. Oh, she got all formal. Yeah, I feel like now that she's seen Russ, she's kind of like, okay. I um. Oh, he cleans up nice. Um, I feel like now that she's seen Russ, she's kind of more into this, but not really. Like, I really do not see her you know, being in a relationship, but she's kind of, I think she's doing it to, um, make Russ mad. So, you know, if she were to get in a relationship, I see it being a rebound or, you know, just, you know, have some fun. She has really got to be. <laughs> All right, go in there. Have a nice time. You love birds. Oh. Willow's latest book, Fifty Shades of Sims 3, fills 184 pages with questionable content. It's ready to be released to stores and fans with a low morality threshold. Early readers of the book have compared it to Zombies, Zombies. Willow will receive six royalty payments of 110 simoleons. Awesome. So, she wants to finish reading a book. I like that hairstyle. Okay, so, um... Let's see. Um, she can make a drama novel or a fiction novel. I don't actually know what the next book I want her to start, but I feel like we'll start it tomorrow. So go ahead and go home. And then he is like totally overworked. Okay. So yeah, Coraline's on her little dates. Cute, cute, cute. So, um, uh, okay, what did I want you to do? Okay, so come here, have like a quick little dinner, and then go to sleep. And then you have a quick little dinner and go to bed as well. And then we'll jump back over here and just kind of. <laughs> she did see some fills strike the perfect balance of great dialogue, engaging characters, and gripping plots. Cor Excuse you. Oh, it went away. <laughs> Either way, she saw a great chick flick, which is good. Okay, Bryce has left work today, finally. Okay, you're almost done. I would have had them eat outside because that would have been really cute, but that, like, they never sit together when they eat outside. It's almost really annoying, and it's not supposed to be that romantic. Okay. Okay, where's your little... Are you still on a date? You are. Okay. There he is. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Um, let's be romantic and... 
Um, give him a hug. Let's take a picture together. And then we can kiss him goodbye. There we go, kiss goodbye. I love that interaction just because it like ends the date on a high note. I don't know why I like it so much. Oh, that's cute. Cute, cute, cute. Sealed out. The air smells fresher. The birds are twittering in delight, and you feel like you're walking on tiptoes as if you might suddenly burst into flight. That date was incredible. Coraline Glass just went on her first date with Phoenix. Hopefully she will remember it as the start of something beautiful and not an embarrassing epic failure. Roses are red, violets are blue. I thought that was a great date. How about you? Photo. And then she wants to kiss him after kissing him. Love it. All right, go home. So now they are romantic interests. I love it. All right, so go home. You are like exhausted, girl, and you probably, you need to pee. All right, so go to the bathroom and take a shower and then go to bed. And I will catch up with you guys when they are awake again in the morning. Guys, 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 look. What? No, wait. What are you doing? Oh, wait, I thought that was something else. What are you why are you looking at it? Why are you looking at it? <gasps> oh! What is that? What? What is that? Whoa! Whoa! What is that? What just happened? What? Where's? Where's? Where? Guys! Guys! Coraline! Guys, get up! <laughs> Coraline's gone! What? Okay. 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 This is, um... Guys. I totally did not think that's what that was. I thought it was... I thought it was something else. I thought it was, um... A... I thought it was, like, the rainbow or something for the unicorn. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh. Who are you? Uh oh, it looks like Coraline was abducted by an alien. Hopefully they were friendly. What? Abducted. Coraline won't, can't help but feel a little probed. What happened up there? No! Wait a minute! What? A uh, what? Um... What just happened? Okay, um, I have never had that happen before in my life. What just, what was that? What, what was that? What was that? Okay, I'm a little weirded out. I'm, I'm a lot weirded out, actually. Um, all right, yeah, sure. Oh my gosh, I don't even understand what just happened. Um, uh, okay, so I'm gonna skip ahead to the morning. Alright, so, um, Willow and Price are up and seem to have no idea that Coraline was abducted in the middle of the night. I still have no idea what the heck happened with that, but, um, they're just gonna chill together. Watch some TV. Um, you want to kiss him? That's great. You want to go on a date with him? You want to walk? Good grief. Um, improving writing skills. We're going to keep them. So she earned. Oh, she's got 7,000 lifetime happiness. What can she get? Because um, I wanted to give her. Speedy Cleaner, Legendary Host. 
Um, let's give her legendary host. Mm. Mm -hmm. And then Great. they don't have enough yet. Okay. Oh my goodness. Is there like can we talk about like do we hear anything outside last night? Like Oh my goodness gracious, this is this is crazy. This is so crazy. Okay, so um I'm going to have do you work today? You do work today. Um bad reception, huh? Go ahead and go fill um Cleo's bowl. And I think I'm going to have you go to the library. Go ahead and go to the bathroom. We're going to have, we're basically just going to be working on skills for a while. Which, um, I'm not so worried so much about Willow's skills as much as just her writing. But, um, I am wanting to get these guys' skills up. So she doesn't work today. And her, I don't know how, if she can get a promotion or not. But I think I'm going to have her work on her painting skill when she gets up. And then Willow, just go ahead and go to the library when you're done. I want the Willow to actually work on her writing skill, but it's kind of hard to do so without... You know, she'll have to, like, read the books, which isn't a problem, but it would be nice if I could find some way to have her, like, ride, like, just kind of rent a horse, if you know what I mean. Oh, there's an equestrian competition today. That's cool. Um, yeah, just, I don't know, like, a way, I'm thinking about building a lot with just like a bunch of horses on it and she can like go and ride um just to make it more realistic what is that certified oh that's the name of the it's like what the heck yeah that's the name of the actual house that's where russ lives he actually lives in a nice house the fall festival has made its way to town awesome Setting up just in time to get everyone in the mood for a spooky day. Don your best costume and come celebrate with us, won't you? Try your luck, the pie eating contest, and apple bobbing tank await. If competition doesn't strike your fancy, grab a city slickers portion and watch from the sidelines. A trip through the haunted house may just leave you a change sim, literally. Cap it all off with a stroll through the pumpkin patch to pick yourself out a carving pumpkin fresh from the farm. Oh, okay, so I really think I want them to go to the fall festival in the next part because fall is my absolute favorite season, guys. I love fall. I just, I adore it so much. I, oh, there's the mail. Okay. Go pay the bills. Um, yes. But yeah, fall is my absolute favorite holiday i love um just i love carving pumpkins i love setting up i don't so much like halloween um i actually don't like halloween at all but i just love fall i love how the colors of the trees change i love how the weather feels because i do not like summer at all i hate the heat i just i love it so much and now spring's coming in real life and it just is it's not the same it's not it's not the same Okay, so go ahead and when you get up, get some leftovers of waffles and then practice your painting. Willow is off to the library. So yeah, I think in the next part we're going to have him go to the fall festival. And if I have to make Bryce call off work, I will because I want them all to go together as a family. Okay, so are you wanting to write a particular book? Because I have no idea what I want you to write. Um, let's start a drama novel just because she just has the ability to do that now. I have no idea what I'm going to call this book, but. Okay, so she's going to eat and do all that. Or in geese. Uh, no. Um. Oh, dear. What should we call this? Um drama what would be <laughs> Coraline's love life 
Coraline's well, love life would be drama. Um, Coraline would kill us if we wrote a book about her love life. Um, I don't know. I never know what to name these books. Maybe I should have just left it what it was. Um, let's do... Whatever pops up next is what we're going to name it because I have no idea. Olivia Blend. Um, sure. It's just... I have no idea. Like, if I actually sat and thought about what I wanted to call it, yeah, but I just... Oh! Our books are actually in the... That's cool. That's awesome. Okay. So. You are getting up and you're going to practice your painting. Oh, you're eating with Bryce. That's... Oh, the TV's on the fritz. Okay, go ahead and repair the TV. Um, is there anything else that's broken? It's Is it bad that I'm actually looking for stuff that's broken? Okay. Um... Go out here and pee so you don't pee in the okay. I love the frost that gets on the ground. Cause what what temperature is it outside? 38 degrees. Oh! Oh! Oh my! Bryce Crawford just received the electrical shock of his life. He can still feel the tingling in his limbs. That one that one's feeling. That's one feeling that won't be forgotten soon. Okay, go clean yourself up. Singed. Sims find it unenjoyable to be electrocuted, especially because it may stop their heart. Until this wears off, Sims should steer clear of further potentially electrifying activities. Oh my gosh, are you serious? Wow. Okay. So you're not singed anymore, so go ahead and go try to repair it again. <laughs> wow, that was insane. Okay, she wants to go to Fall Festival 2. Does Willow? What does she want to do? Make at least 250 in royalties per week. Okay, she does want to go to the Fall Festival. Bryce does not. Okay. Well, Bryce, you're going anyway. Alright, that was crazy. If he gets singed again, I swear... Like, I swear, I will be so mad. Okay, so guys, um, when Bryce was fixing the TV for the second time, the game actually crashed. So, um, I didn't have to play that far ahead because it was, like, right before Coraline got abducted by the alien, which is good. So, um, I'm just gonna play up to the point where, if even the TV breaks this time around. Um, and I was gonna end the part anyway, so... It's not like you guys mixed anything. You didn't even, you know, finish <laughs> doing it. So I am going to end this part here. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you want to see more videos from me, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next part. Bye, you guys.